Jayanti Talapati from Gateway, the complete school. Actually, uh, this question, uh, if you've seen, it's dilute hydrochloric acid is added to aqueous barium nitrate in a test tube. So what happens? The pH of the liquid in the test tube and a precipitate forms. So you need to tell whether uh, you get, uh, whether uh, the precipitate forms or not or whether the pH decreases or increases. So that we are going to see now. Here I have taken barium nitrate salt and this is a barium nitrate solution. So I am making a solution of barium nitrate. So in a barium nitrate solution, I am going to add HCl. So hydrochloric acid, dilute hydrochloric acid. So if you add barium chloride, I mean barium nitrate with HCl. So the question says, I mean uh, in the question they have asked whether you will get a precipitate or not, right? So there is no precipitate over here. So no precipitate and uh, we are going to see whether the pH increases or decreases. But uh, the barium nitrate, the pH of barium nitrate is 5 to 8, okay? So here this is, there is no precipitate over here. So we are going to test it with the indicator. So here I have the universal indicator. So when I put universal indicator, we will get to know the pH of the solution. So if it is uh, red or pink, it is acid. And I said 5 to 8 only the pH of barium nitrate. So uh, we are going to see whether the pH increases or decreases. I think you can see the red color over here. So that shows the pH decreases to 5 to 2 or 3, right? So pH increases, uh, sorry, decreases. So that shows the solution is acidic now. So this proves dilute, dilute hydrochloric acid if, uh, if you add with barium nitrate solution, the pH decreases, right? And the precipitate, no. So the answer is B. Thank you so much for watching.